I ask for the truth on behalf of MacKayar concerning relationship issues and ask this in the name of truth, right conduct, peace, love and non-violence. Blessed be to the truth always. And we just cut the uh, deck for you there, mate. And uh, just pop the cards over here. Uh, wanting to know if uh, anything from the love angle, as you would say, is uh, going to be looming this year. Let's just see uh, what's going on then. We'll we'll deal out three cards. Uh, we usually have a beginning, middle and end, so we have the beginning there, the middle there, and then the end there. It's a story, isn't it, really? That's all it is, all said and done. Um, <coughs> in this particular case, your story, uh, we do past, present and future. So, so we have... Uh, the recent past, it's not a moon phase behind or the moon phase in front, so it's like the last three or four weeks or so ago with the next three or four weeks ahead and then of course Metkiar in the middle there just uh, uh, doing what he's doing. Well let's see where you were of course from a relationship point of view, from a love point of view as you would say, where were you in in the past three or four weeks or so. We'll just get this card here and we'll just flip that over and then we'll just uh, see what's going on there for you. Um, you've got the element of Earth. Um, this one seems to be coming up quite a lot just lately, doesn't it? Uh, the element of Earth indicating really uh, you've been a bit sens I say you've been sensible. You've been uh, obviously utilising logic, reason, common sense, re realism, uh, and, and, and of course, you've been realistic about it. It's, if it's not worth falling in love with her, although, although I want to fall in love with her, but nevertheless, if it's not realistic to be with her, then I won't be with her. Which is a fair enough thing to do, isn't it? Um, is there any love looming this time? Then, of course, maybe if you like doing your own thing and, and, and you're too much your own man, then, of course, you, you've got that problem, haven't you? Uh, I just don't bother doing loneliness, I just do solitude. It's easier. But laughing and joking apart, of course, uh, although I don't understand the concept of loneliness, uh, a lot of people do, especially if they've had somebody under the feet all the time or if they've been under somebody else's feet and uh, can't get used to uh, just having a bit of freedom. Uh, the the less, less, of, uh, less of my opinions uh, on it, more though, more, more, more met for, for you really, this is about you, not me. Um, but definitely, you, you, you're, not, you're, not, you're not a fool. Let's put it that way, you haven't been foolish uh, when it's come to relationship issues over the past, maybe the Christmas period as well, when it can be tempting to meet people at parties or, or, or whatever. You've sort of uh, resisted the devil and the devil has fleed from you because maybe it's not in your best of interests at the moment. Maybe you're not financially stable. I don't know. Let's see what's happening now. This will say probably why things are they are now, of course. There, you've got the, the siren. A temptation is leading you astray. Don't tell me this is the same bloody reading as before. No, it isn't. We've had this before. Well, we've had the same same two two out of three and the, and the cards have come out there. So you've got the, the siren there. And of course, for your immediate future, you've got the um, the mystic circle. Um, temptations, yes, right now it seems to be quite prevalent for a lot of people. That's quite significant here. Where a temptation right now is leading you astray, you may be just uh, taken in by a young lady who, who is luring you in, maybe for the wrong reasons. You, you're the one who's not the fool. You're the one who's been pragmatic, you're the one who's been realistic, and yet it's tempting, isn't it, just to, for the sake of telling your friends, I've got somebody as well as, 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 well as you have now. Uh, but of course, your abilities will be enhanced in the next three or four weeks or so. I want to pull another card out here, just to see what happens after that, where your abilities, you've got, you've got the fourth arc there, the, the runes, just, just indicating that... Uh, 
the, the magic that's uh, around the corner for you. In, but more to do with in the sense of God helps those who help themselves in the sense that uh, your abilities will be there and, and you will be using those abilities to uh, maybe resist the devil that may flee from you I don't know let's see what just happens f further down the line there uh, yes you've got the golem there just indicating the close friend will probably act on your behalf they'll speak out for you maybe put a good word in for you maybe they that somebody else although we don't believe in sort of arranged marriages and things like that maybe nevertheless there's somebody there who say oh i know a young lady who, who like you because i know you it's probably a friend of course naturally they say i know what you like and uh, i got a funny feeling she's going to like you and uh, i got a funny feeling like i say me i got the feeling as though uh, although your friend would say i got a funny feeling that you like it. i sort of got the funny feeling as though as well that this is uh, from a love point of view it's not so much you you the temptation that leads you astray right now and who it is right now it might be the same person i don't know but it's not so much the temptation that leads you astray now that i'm at it's more to do with uh, who else knows you uh, not what you know but who you know in the sense of who knows you and who might put in a good word for you around about February, late February, March, something like that, springtime. That'll be the time when uh, when the god when the goddess brings the life force back onto the earth again, and uh, the new cycle begins or whatever, isn't it? So it's just about being patient, isn't it? Really, I think. And 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 at the end of the day, do you need your freedom? Sure as hell you do. Uh, enjoy it while you've got it, because uh, you're only young once as well, aren't you? So enjoy that as well. Um, don't wish your life away. Uh, although that's easy for me to say, easy for anybody to say. Nevertheless, it'll come when you're not expecting it. It'll be probably a close friend who puts a good word in for you. And maybe you, maybe if this temptation that leads you astray right now, maybe you haven't got the the sort of guts or whatever you want to call it to sort of approach that person that you've got your eye on maybe the close friend uh, won't so much I suppose put in a good word but maybe that, that you, you'll ask them you'll say yeah, have a word with have a word with such and such a body she's a nice girl and uh, just put a good word in for me or uh, just tell her cause just tell her I've got my eye on her and uh, make it look as if you think uh, as if you think we have you know when when, when you know for what I have uh, that sort of thing Matt. so so you've just got to sort of play the game aren't you a bit really there uh, but around about March I think you, you should be in for a, and be able to go in for the kill as you would say so with that all the best for you and uh, best best I'll look to you if that's really what you want just enjoy your freedom until then <laughs> the, the clock is ticking for now, these cards have spoken.